Shalom, Israelite School, UPK. Go to IshaVK.com for more information. More on this DNA hoax. Autosomal, D, autosomal tests, which means you go from the father and the mother side for DNA pool. Tests are also provide information about an individual's ethnicity by identifying sections of their DNA that best match reference databases of modern populations. So they got da databases and they categorize them. By uh, uh, autosomal tests provide information about an individual's ethnicity by identifying sections of DNA tests. Now, uh, with modern populations with geographical or ethnical labels, ethnicity tests are better called biographical ancestry tests or admixture tests. Your ethnicity is a social category that may not accurately reflect your ancestry. Your ethnicity may not reflect your ancestry. However, the reference populations used for comparison purposes are limited. So that means there's only a few groups that they label. So if you're a black American and they want to label you across the, all the border, they'll just stick you with Africa. They'll just make, okay, your DNA is, 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 is DNA. Let's just put that as African DNA. Let's put that West African DNA. We're going to show you how. Your ethnicity is a social category that may not accurately reflect your ancestry. It's social. It means it's what people think. However, the reference populations used for comparison purposes are limited. The ethnic labels applied to them may be questionable, and they were collected in different ways for different purposes. They collected in different ways, different purposes. So they'll get a black man who lived in Africa and say, look, okay, we got people who can get with your DNA in that gene pool. Let's label all of them West Africans because that's the social norm. That don't mean you ain't no Israelite. That don't mean the Africans is not is the same as Israelites. It's blacks in America. That means that the scientists group you as the same because that's what social norm. It's the social category. Because the population itself may be may not be precisely defined, populations usually overlap and blend with other populations. Distinguishes, distinguishing between populations within contents, continents is often poor with the current resolution of markers and databases. So if you're on the same damn continent, you got the DNA. That's how they're doing the DNA. Oh, just some body and uh, people, you, you are socially categorized with African because you're African-American, politically correct. So your DNA goes with the African DNA. Oh, you're white. Your DNA goes with the European DNA, and we'll just match it with one of the European groups because that's what that's how it's socially acceptable. So stop going with this ancestry crap. They lumping us all in one damn thing because we got black skin. That's what they're really doing. Oh, you got dark skin? You must be an African. Everybody in dark skin, let's put all their genetic markers in the African category. And then when you a black man, go do your DNA, it tell you West African pa boom boom poo up in some damn place somewhere, and you ain't it ain't telling you shit. It ain't telling you nothing, but what's the social norm, what everybody thinks already. With that, shalom.